हेलो गुजरात वी हैव विद अस प्रोफेसर डॉक्टर विजया लक्ष्मी शी इज फ्रॉम मारवाड़ी यूनिवर्सिटी राजकोट एंड इन वर्किंग इन द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ कम्युनिकेशन स्किल्स प्रोफेसर डॉक्टर विजया लक्ष्मी इज अ पोएट एंड ऑथर वी विल टॉक टुडे अबाउट हर पोएट्रीज एंड हर बुक्स वेलकम विजया लक्ष्मी what inspire you to write book i started writing poems from the age of 15 um i used to pen down my deepest mm-hmm. thoughts feelings and experience in my diary and over the years when i saw these collections i it gave me a sense of pride and happiness and i thought that i should write mm-hmm. and uh, i usually wrote to find my latent self hidden in them uh, because r- uh, writing gives you an exposure beyond borders and boundaries true in whatever you wish to write and i'm very grateful to my father who taught me the value of time mm-hmm. and my husband who believed in me what was your father's name my father's name is uh, uh, d j raman and uh, he is a retired bank manager and now he is into real estate business and my husband is vijay surya he is working as a plant manager in indian oil corporation so what the man uh, inspired you also okay yes good usually it is told that there is a woman behind every successful man but here we find that there are two men be- father and husband behind this successful woman so it's indeed uh, nice to listen to you Tell us about your uh, publications so far. Um, my first book is a novel that is a quest for God, an epiphany, which was published in the year two thousand fifteen. Mm-hmm. My second book is Poems on the Eternal God, okay. which is an anthology and published in two thousand sixteen by the Chief Minister of Pondicherry. And my third book is a research one, which is entitled A Postmodernist Critique of the Select Works of Amitav Ghosh. which was released during the Ahmedabad literature festival recently how long does it take to write a book it took me around 2 to 3 months mm-hmm. to complete a book uh, because i believe that once the thought process starts uh, it goes on how do you describe poems on the eternal god your collection of poetry is addressed to god actually poems on the eternal god is a collection of poems which is very close to my heart um, the collection is divided into two parts mm-hmm. the first section is realization and the second section is entitled omkara and uh, uh, everyone believes in god do they yes so either uh, so my uh, no connection is with god shiva uh, i believe that uh, god help me okay god help me I, at each and every moment and when even when i had difficulties i used to pray to god mm-hmm. shiva and there were na na like uh, mm-hmm. solutions of it so here uh, i dedicate this book to god shiva so actually here i have explored the binary opposites of smiles tears happiness sadness and i also have also explored the various numbers that is the four vedas the five essentials of life 32 chromosomes and 64 art forms everything revolves around god so this is the gist of it and uh, so where is this book available from if anyone want to buy it uh, this book is available on amazon mm-hmm. and what is the favorite uh, poetry from the anthology yes we would like to listen to it yes um the favorite poet uh, poetry from the anthology is faith uh, i would like to read it mm-hmm. to you of what use is faith is self faith futile believe in yourselves yet believe in god believe in divinity yet believe in the divine within you De- believe in myths yet believe in the myth of human existence believe in vedas yet believe in the vedic enchantment of your lives believe in sacrifice yet believe in the self sacrifice of your soul believe in ceremonies yet believe in the greater ceremony of life believe in positive forces yet believe in the positivity of your struggle believe in the cosmos yet believe in the cosmic enforcement of your heart believe in prayers 
yet believe in the prayer of achievement and finally believe in spirituality yet believe in the supreme spiritual in each and every cell of your makeup the two uncanny forces replicate the earth yet renovates the abode of god it's wonderful so this is uh, mm -hmm. the poem which is close to my heart it is entitled truth and beauty is truth sorry is beauty the truth or is truth beautiful which comes first beauty is it the outward appearance or an inner frame of consciousness does beauty lie in nature or in the lovable atman state can one attain beauty truth its meaning meaning lies far beyond life what's truth where does it lie is it in the speaker's mind or heart which one is the dwelling who is god does he exist why can't one see him did he really exist within us truth beauty god define our life one may not change the color of his skin yet he can change his heart with sincerity when the heart attains truth the mind achieves beauty the two co-joined elevates the god in us for god signifies truth beauty symbolizes god and hence and hence the truth and beauty are sagas om namah shivaya wonderful so this was your poetry truth and beauty, beauty yes. you please tell us more about your future projects what you are working now um right now i am uh, focusing on my collection of short stories okay um it is based on the lines of suspense romance and thriller mm -hmm. and then i have also written 200 poems oh. based on the lines of word poetry which is entitled you and me and i have also written two novels and uh, in future i would like to write uh, more poems and uh, novels which would interest the readers uh, vijaya lakshmi ji i have also seen you on a blog wish to write.com please tell us more about it i found a uh, wish to write blog very interesting and i have posted my poems and uh, two of my poems that is you and me and uh, what is will par so it became famous overnight and actually wish to write is a platform for youngsters and others to explore their talents and to post it to post a uh, poem short stories novellas uh, which is short uh, novels or paintings or drawings or any other writings which they find it will uh, let us uh, convenient for them uh, would you like to share with readers your email id or contact detail where they can contact you Yes, uh, definitely. My mail ID is uh, vijaylakshmi dot surya at gmail dot com. It is v i j a y a l a k s h a m i dot s u r y a at the rate gmail dot com. Thank you, and wish you best for your all projects. Thank you, sir.